Nafo, congratulations, welcome to Australia. You arrived yesterday, it's been a little chance to look around, moved into your house with your family today. How's the first 24, 36 hours in South Wales going? Uh, pretty, uh, very welcoming. Uh, got got in uh, yesterday morning, I was uh, quite a bit of a uh, long flight. Just had a stopover in LA, but it was finally good to, good to get here actually. So looking forward to the next couple of days and um, hopefully get out there soon. And you've just moved into your home on Aberavon Seafront, sun is shining, what more could you ask for? Yeah, yeah, so the weather is not what they've told me, so I'm hoping it sticks around for as long as it, uh, as it can, the sun. And you're straight down to work, uh, well advanced in rehab, you had an injury early in the Super Rugby season, yeah. well advanced in your rehab, how far away do you think you're going to be from uh, perhaps being able to put on the Ospreys jersey? Um, I'm not really sure yet, I, I thought I was about two, maybe four weeks away, but... Uh, we're gonna, I've got more testing today, and the physio will um, will determine what what he reckons is going to be a, a time period for me to be to be back by. So we'll see. And the physio is always bossing these these decisions. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, looking forward to getting out there anyway. So hopefully not too long. You come to Australia with a reputation as a strong scrummager, a physical ball carrier. Is that what fans can expect to see you when you pull on the shirt? Um, hopefully, hopefully. Um, I've worked hard, worked hard on my scrumming from my, from my, from my early early days of my career. So hopefully that's something I can bring into the team. And um, obviously I like to play rugby a wee bit, carry the ball, which is always kind of the fun part of rugby. So hopefully if I can get involved with that, if the game plan um, lets me do it, then yeah, something I, I, can, uh, I can contribute with. And you come to the Ospreys from New Zealand, and there's obviously you've got fans up in the pavilion there. Um, you come to the Ospreys from New Zealand. Uh, what do you know about the Ospreys, about the Pro 12, about Welsh rugby in general? Oh, I kind of knew a wee bit just from uh, looking, following the, the Heineken Cup, and um, I knew a few of the past All Blacks had come, come to Ospreys, um, like it was Jerry Collins in it. So. Um, but I didn't really know much about the, the structure of the league and that, but once I knew I signed up, I kind of did a wee bit of research on how it worked and how the the Europe, European Cup, it's called now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah so I'm um, a bit more familiar with it now, so, yeah. And the Northern Hemisphere season's a bit longer than what you used to down south as well? Yeah, definitely. Um, definitely, I had a look at the schedule and uh, there's a few few more games than, than we, we we usually do have down down in New Zealand. So. Have you looked at the World Cup to perhaps keep an eye on some of the Ospreys players that you're going to be playing with who are coming back to the region this week after their unfortunate exit on the weekend? Yeah, definitely did keep, keep an eye on the Welsh team, especially uh, knowing that the, the Ospreys are uh, Ospreys players had had they had um, quite a quite a few players involved in it in that um, campaign. So a bit unlucky on the in the quarters but looking forward to meeting some of them so and I suppose it's a case of getting the shirt on getting some work done and getting out into action to feel really part of the Osprey setup yeah yeah so that's the main part I think was uh, getting the injury right getting the getting back in the training and and playing so and, and helps arrive in after a first win of the season as well with a bit more positive spirit in the camp yeah definitely definitely I think the from what I've heard, it hasn't been the greatest start, but it's understandable with the amount of players who are away in the World Cup. So hopefully it's a, it's a change of training with, with the first, first win on the weekend and the boys can keep it going.